Today, we will be creating parodies of Edvard Munch's The Scream. This iconic work of art is a powerful visual symbol created for the anxieties of modern life. Remember, a parody is an imitation of a particular artist with deliberate exaggeration for comic effect. So, to be funny, I'm going to create a parody of The Scream using the Brambleton Bear. My bear is screaming because the sky has turned the Brambleton colors, red, dark blue, and light blue. First thing I do is lightly sketch with a pencil. I sketch out my horizon line and the lines for the bridge. I try to make it look like it's getting further away by having the lines converge at a vanishing point that's just off the page. Then, of course, I draw my Brambleton bear screaming. For this project, you can choose whatever drawing media you want to work with. I'm going to do a little bit with colored pencils. I like to use colored pencils on the small areas, so I start with colored pencils on my Brambleton bear. Then I'm going to move into some chalk pastels. So to use my chalk pastels, I'm going to just turn them on their side as well as use the tip to get different sizes of lines. And chalk pastel can be blended very easily, so I'll use my fingers to blend them in the direction that I want the sky to go, and that would be horizontal in this case. The pastels do get on your fingertips, so be careful not to smudge them all over your paper. I decide I kind of want to switch to oil pastels. The chalk was getting a little messy, so I switched to oil pastels in my water. I'm using the same colors from my sky to have them reflect. I want the red and blues to reflect into the water, which is different than the real screen, but remember this is a parody, so I can make changes like that. I will then continue to use oil pastels for the remainder of my picture. You can switch back and forth to different media as you choose. Oil pastels can pretty much go on top of anything. Um, once you're using oil pastels and chalk though, it is hard to use markers on top of those items. So keep that in mind. If you want to use any markers, use those first. This is my end result. I'm pleased with it, and I can't wait to see what you guys do with your parodies. Have a great time with this assignment.